Greetings. I'm Bob Porter, the host of Portraits in Blue. On your way home tonight, I hope you'll check us out on WBEZ 91.5 FM. We'll be on at 11 o'clock with a show on the late Stevie Ray Vaughan. Our next musical set is going to honor the memory of the great Robert Johnson. And to perform this for you, we have a mixture of musicians who have known and associated with Robert Johnson directly and performers who have performed his repertoire with authenticity and distinction for many years. We are talking about Johnny Shines. We are talking about Robert Jr. Lockwood, Jackie Torrance, John Hammond, and to tie it all together, the great Taj Maha. Thank you. Thank you. I'd like to start off uh, right away with uh, one, uh, a version of one of Robert's compositions that I really like a lot. It's called Come On In My Kitchen.
an Ivy loving Took off my so-called friend Joe mm. ain't never gonna get lucky Steal her back again Come on In my kitchen Honey, going to be raining All the women sing, you better come home in my kitchen, cause it's going to be raining out though. Let's sing it together, Sue. You better come home in my kitchen, huh, cause it's going to be raining out Thank you. <clears throat> I'd like to introduce them as she has been introduced before and you've seen her around. This is a wonderful storyteller carrying on a great tradition of telling those stories that keep you going. We like to work together. This is Jackie Torrance. <laughs> like a lot of words in our language, is an abstract term. It's, it's used to describe abstract situations. For instance, you've worked a 40-hour week, and at the end of that week, you open your paycheck, and you start counting up. You count up everything that came out, and you realize that you've made the same amount working 40 hours that you made last week and you didn't work but two days. Now all of a sudden there's something down in the pit of your stomach and there's nothing to describe that feeling but you have to say you've got the... Now, another situation comes up. You've been in a relationship for 20 years. And you've done everything you could to keep that relationship going. One morning you turn over and put your hand on your honey. And it ain't no honey there. You realize that honey was gone last week. There's some kind of feeling in the pit of your stomach. What do you call it? You're walking along the street. You've been walking all day long. It's been a long time since the last meal you've had. You stand in front of a restaurant that smells like bacon, and it smells like fresh bread, and, and, it, and it smells like fresh coffee brewing. And you put your hand in your pocket to taste to see how many funds you got. There's a dime and three pennies. And you know you can't buy nothing with that. You get this funny feeling in the pit of your stomach. And it's called... Yeah. Now, there are not too many people in this world who can describe that. It's a lot of people who, who, who need to hear folks sing about it. Somebody came along about 80 years ago. Little black boy was born down in the Delta. He'd go out early in the morning and he'd work all day. And when he'd come in, the folks would laugh at him because he was dusty from his head to his toe. And they'd holler at him and say, Dusty, what you been doing, boy? Dusty. They called him Dusty. One day, Dusty started playing the Jews' harp. He liked the sound of it. And then he took up the harmonica. He started slipping into the barrel houses and the juke joints. And he got a, a taste of, uh, of watching the blues men play. And he got the feeling like that's what he wanted to do. Now Dusty, you see, had a mama and a daddy. His mama's name was Julia. 
His daddy's name was Noah. But his daddy didn't stay around long. He had to leave Memphis. Had to leave for Memphis to hide out from some men who didn't like him so much. His name was Noah Johnson. And little Dusty didn't know too much about him, but he liked that name, so he took it. Started calling himself Robert. Robert Johnson. And all Robert Johnson could hear were the men playing in the barrel house. And he could hear the women folks say, go on, blues man, do it again. And he liked that sound. And one day, Robert Johnson decided that he was going to find out what was behind the blues men. And he went out to find folks like Johnny Shaw. Go right on. Go right on. Go right on. Yes, Mr. Johnny Shine and Mr. Robert Jr. Lockwood, the closest you're going to come to Robert Johnson today. Walking, breathing, living, and looking well and feeling good. Yeah.
You can call him Satan. You can call him Hellzabah, but he likes devil. He took her advice, and they say he went to the crossroads, cause the next year that he showed up with the guitar in his hand, he was a master. He played sometimes late in the night. 
He played sometimes early in the morning. The women folks followed him wherever he went. He was tall, dark, and handsome, they say. And when he played, he had folks in the palm of his hand. Now, Robert Johnson moved from place to place, but it seemed to be something troubling him. Seemed like the hounds of hell was on his tail. When he played, you could hear it in his music. You could hear it in his voice. You could hear it in the lyrics that he, that he sung. Somebody was haunting him. Something was haunting him. But that music went on and on. He never stopped. He kept playing. Folks was listening everywhere. Folks heard him and loved him. Folks like Robert Lockwood. Folks like John Hammond. Go ahead. Johnny Shines. I'm going to take this opportunity for these three gentlemen to get together here and set something right on you. Right. My 
baby don't love me I've been in love that woman Can't stand to leave her be Now you know it ain't but the one thing That makes Mr. Johnson drink I get worried about the way you treat me, baby And I begin to think recording sessions and he was on his way to his third when a jealous husband poisoned his whiskey. It took Robert Johnson away. The devil had his soul. He's gone, they say. The hounds of hell caught up with him. But I want you to know, just listen and feel he's everywhere in all the music of the blues. You hear his sound. You can't silence him. He may have been poisoned, but he lives on. He lives on in the sounds that you hear today. He lives on in the sounds that you hear right here. You can't kill his words. You can't kill his music. It's as alive as it ever will be. He's right here. The blues ain't nothing but a low down, shaking, aching chill. Well, if you don't ever understand that, honey, you never will. Well, if you ain't had them, I hope you never will. So says Robert Johnson. Thank you, Jackie Torrance. Ladies and gentlemen, the wonderful Jackie Torrance. Have you ever walked up a 
Well, I'm blue man, well, I'm better. Go now, shake and chill. Well, I'm blue man, well, I'm better. Go now, shake and chill. But you ain't never had a crazy nerve. I got women from Pittsburgh. Be on the end of Tennessee. I got women from Pittsburgh, on the end of Tennessee. But my fat queen women they jump all over. I've been on and down, 
standing backstage and it was like somebody reached around the corner the curtain of the stage into the back room and said on stage right now mom <laughs> and it was the big throw down
do, we'll do, we'll do, that's my girl. Disconnect 
Until I get satisfied I just could play a bunch of these Robert Johnson songs that have motivated me in my life to make a career of playing blues.
Johnson could probably play in any style. Anything he heard on the radio, he could play it exactly. And he came up with some outrageous tunes, and one of them was uh, Hot Tamales. Hot Tamales about a red hot. Yes, we got them too. Hot Tamales got a red hot. Yes, we got them to sell. I got two phone niggas I bought with dime. I would 
say you love, but they ain't none of mine. Oh, Lord, it red. Yes, we got them to say. Now hang them out and out of red. Yeah, we got them to say. Oh, child of red. Yes, we got them to say. Well, I got a gas that you're long and tall. Sleeps in the kitchen with a free in the hall. Oh, Lord, it red. Yes, we got them to say. Come on now, he don't be there. I said, hot the money, the red hot now. Yes, we got him to say. Well, the Billy Go fell in the Bumblebee's nest. Never since then, he can't take this business. Who's child of red hot? Yeah, we got him to say. Hot the money, the red hot. Yeah, we got him to say. Who's child of red hot? Yes, we got him to say. Well, Grandma like him and Grandpa too. Well, I wonder what the world we're two gonna do. Who know the red hot? Yeah, we got him to say. I'm gonna be a four men and ride that thing along the running boat. The ooh, child of red hot. Yeah, we got him to say. Now don't you mess with my hot tamale now, cause I swear it's gonna be bad. But don't you mess with a man, cause I'm me. Yes, it's gonna be bad. I'm gonna up to your back door, put your kid in the sleep, do a break away, you live until your heart's a peach. Ooh, child of red hot. Yeah, we got him to say. Well, the Billy Goat fell in the Bumblebee's nest. And ever since then, he can't take his grace. Who's shot a red hot? Yeah, we got him to say, come on now, dear. I said a hot day. Yes, we got him to say. Well, I got a gas that's long and tall. Sleeps in the kitchen with a food in the hall. Who's shot a red hot? Yes, we got him. Yes, we got him. Yes, we got him to say.
man is old, blues and bad. Plus, no fear that I'm old. Must have a hand. Some people tell me. All this word blues and bad. Well, I said, 
Thank you so much.